There's a bigger need for collaboration between industry and colleges now more than ever, because as things get more technical, as things get more uh, advanced, uh, that makes the industry stronger, that makes the equipment better, uh, but it also uh, steepens the learn learning curve for the students going out into the field. Siemens has a great uh, organization uh, that is able to not only deliver us the components and the actual uh, tools that we need uh, for student learning, but they're also great at giving us advice as far as saying what other industries uh, are using. So that way the students uh, from our program uh, have a leg up on the competition and they, they already know and have their hands on uh, actual devices and equipment that's already being used uh, in industry. I have worked with Siemens as much as I could to uh, incorporate their material into my teaching. Uh, I found that uh, it was to my students' advantage when they, entered, when they went to the job market to say they had some Siemens experience. We are working with Siemens very close. We can say shoulder to shoulder because we have a lot of software and hardware that they provide to us in order that the students can be trained in that direction. They provided the, the trainers for us to use. Uh, we use the Simmons PLCs. Uh, we even use a few of them with our Kawasaki's. Um, they're in pretty much every big uh, automation project that we have here. So just the combination of the two is getting a lot more practice with a lot of these different machines to kind of understand how everything comes together. I mean, it's just cool. I mean, who doesn't like big robots? My name is LaShondra Perry. Earlier, I was a chemical engineer who felt like I should have been a mechanical engineer. And then I went on and had a family. And then I learned about the Kennesaw State's uh, mechatronics program, and it felt like perfect for me. My favorite thing about this program is hands-on access to industrial robotics that I will actually use and see in the real world. There is a lot of focus on career-ready training, whether it's, I mean, just knowing what the stuff looks like in general. Uh, I mean, opening up some of the panels on this thing, it's just identifying which part is which and kind of why it works and how everything's connected. We are using a lot of software and hardware from Siemens in order to create a next generation manufacturing system to incorporate Industry 4.0 trends. For example, the industrial Internet of Things, how we can use it with, based on the instruments and controls, how we can connect with machine learning, how we can connect with cloud manufacturing to make more smart manufacturing. And our students are going to be very attractive for companies because they know that Industry 4.0 trends, a new technology required to make the next generation automa automation system that we are calling smart manufacturing. My name is Chris Dow. I'm the lead instructor for KTech, which is a workforce initiative as part of the Kids to Love Foundation. The Kids to Love Foundation is a foster child support system here in the state of Alabama. Our main focus is to give those aging out of foster care uh, opportunities in the job market with local industries. It's one of our kind of intrinsic values that you have to have some sort of certification, some credential. And the Siemens credential being internationally recognized does bring that kind of, okay, you've done, we can understand exactly what you've done in terms of technical abilities. And, and therefore I can feel confident that I can get a certain amount of skills out of you and, and have an expectation for success downstream. It's a confidence builder if you can make something work and see it work in a lab and then you can convey that to a to an interview and, and get a get a better job. It's all about getting a better job and it's about keeping the job. Automate processes, make things work. It's one of the most fantastic jobs you'll ever have. <laughs>